Well, the Biden administration is taking an unusual step in banning an antivirus program from being sold in the U.S. Now, the fear is that the program might have ties to the Russian government. Jamie Tucker explains how to find and delete the program on your computer. Antivirus software protects computers, but there are some serious concerns about one called Kaspersky and whether it could be used by the Russian government to infiltrate or even shut down every computer running it. Kaspersky is considered by many as the gold standard in antivirus programs. It was used by federal and state agencies, critical infrastructure, hospitals and businesses. But it's also based in Moscow, and that has U.S. security experts worried the Russian government could demand the company turn over data or even control of the computers running the programs. Antivirus programs have unrestricted access to any computer running it. Nefarious software can install files like malware and keylogger so it knows what you type on the keyboard. And software installed on millions of computers could simultaneously execute a command to shut down at any moment using a kill switch. In explaining the ban, Mark Warner, chair of the Senate Intelligence Committee, said we would never give an adversarial nation the keys to our networks or devices, so it's crazy to think we would continue to allow Russian software with the deepest possible device access to be sold to Americans. Now, to find out if Kaspersky is on your computer, open Settings, then choose Apps. If you see it, follow the uninstall instructions. Or use a program like Revo Uninstaller, which scans the entire computer looking for hidden files Kaspersky may have installed and deletes them. The ban will prevent sales, downloads, installs, and security updates of any Kaspersky product in the U.S. It goes into effect in September to give business owners an opportunity to find a new antivirus solution. That's what the tech. I'm Jamie Tucker.